Folks, this is a new video showing you how you can build a mini PC workstation from an uh, Intel TV box. This in this case, I have a Ricomagic MK36 TV box and a simple monitor. I have a very old monitor, so you can build your own workstation. It's enough for uh, surfing the web. Running office or open office, playing games, it's a cheap solution and you can do it for a hundred bucks, hundred and twenty bucks approximately. So it's very cheap. So, what you need is if your monitor only has an edge, uh, doesn't have an HDMI port, it only has a VGA and DVI, you just buy a simple. The DVI to HDMI converter and you hook it up inside the monitor of course and you connect it to the HDMI cable so in this case it's already connected on the back let me show you if I can here it is that's the plug, the converter, adapter, so it's very cheap, it cost about uh, two, two bucks, I think, very nice. So let's, uh, let's go into the operating system, you can see it runs very, very nicely. This is the desktop mode, you can switch to desktop from tiles mode uh, here I have pre-installed few applications like uh, LibreOffice you can see it runs very nice let me run runs ok so basically the clock speed of the device the CPU runs at uh, 1.3 GHz and of course the device has 2 GB RAM and uh, 32 GB internal storage but you have less after the operating system is installed again I have installed Kodi also works very nice you have Internet Explorer works very smooth and um, what else? The Wi Fi information here. It's a mini PC basically, like I said. Okay. Of course, you can share printers. This drive connected to an external SATA drive with the USB port. Here you have a Win2 Android switch, so we can switch into Android operating system. Basically, I don't use it. I'm staying in Windows uh, environment, but let me show you how, how I'm switching. You just click on the switch to Android, choose yes. And it switches into Android 4.4. KitKat operating system so you basically have a mini PC with two operating systems dual boot option and it works well I prefer Windows Windows 80.1 it looks better I think Okay, it takes a few seconds to load. And of course I've connected it to uh, the box to a standard keyboard and mouse. It's also pretty cheap. Here, I'm, here is the Android operating system, also nice. If you want to switch back into Windows environment, you Choose OS switch 
and it switches back into Windows desktop mode into the Windows 8.1 sorry so you can enjoy two operating systems in one device you can connect a video conferencing uh, camera on the top of the monitor but it's not a must must have let's go into the windows environment what else you can find there you have all the basic things here, Skype, mail, news, weather okay I need to connect it to my Wi-Fi again and you can you do this simply by clicking here to connect to my local network ok it's connected let me show you surfing also works very nice it works very smooth you can see Let's see in the website. Forward advertising. Okay, very smooth. So, surfing is also good. And uh, let me show other things. You have Bing map, Bing Maps here. It's like Google Maps, Google Maps also works very smooth. Microsoft added and uh, what else? Basically that's it. You have a weather option to see local weather forecasts. Also very nice idea by Microsoft. So that's basically the Windows 8.1 operating system on the Rico Magic MK36. Hope you enjoyed my short introduction how to build a cheap mini PC. And uh, thanks for watching. Bye.